Hello, my name is Angelo with Prior Products, a frost-proof wall hydrant manufacturer out of Kansas City, Missouri. Today we want to talk about codes that are relevant to your frost-proof wall hydrants. Many different cities and municipalities across the country have codes in place that will prevent backflow conditions. What that means for you is we do not want water that may be in a bucket full of chemicals or in a pool or in a kiddie pool or something along those lines to allow water back into the potable water system where you are drinking, cooking, bathing. So many different standards have been put in place over the years that will prevent that from taking place. And today we want to address the two main features you're going to find on most frostproof wall hydrants. The first one is going to be the anti-siphon vacuum breaker on top. The best way to describe this is when you take your thumb and you put it on top of a straw and you pull it out of the water, the water stays inside the straw until you break that vacuum. When you release your thumb, the water vacates the system. Your anti-siphon vacuum breaker operates in the same way. In a pressurized system, you're having water flow out. It's coming through. This will have a floating poppet that will seal and it causes a vacuum. If there's ever a backflow condition and there's a draw on the line and the water tries to go back, it pulls that poppet down off of that seal and it breaks the vacuum, allowing water to drain back the other direction instead of going into the system. Now many codes want a double check. So that means that this isn't enough. And in that instance, we also provide a backflow boot inside the hydrant. This is a stem that runs inside the valve and goes to the back where it is shutting off the water. And on the end, you're going to see a little rubber boot. This rubber boot is a backflow preventer. Operates the same way as that vacuum breaker, but it's a little bit more simplified in regards to water flows in, it flows over this boot, but in a backflow condition, water that tries to go that way will get inside the rubber boot and can't go back into that potable water source. These codes are very important to help keep all of our supply water safe and non-contaminated. If you should have questions or want more information about codes, please feel free to reach out to Prior Products at any time. Thank you.